Hey, Chief Nowski here. And I am Assistant Chief Lawrence Kelly. We both would like to wish you a very happy and spooky Halloween this fall, and along with that comes the risks that present themselves during this Halloween season. From car decorations, house decorations, and trick-or-treaters, this month is going to put a lot in front of you. Needless to say, house decorations can be very eye catch <clears throat> Sorry about my radio. Anyway, house decorations can be very eye-catching. If you are having a battle with your friendly neighbors over decorations, please make sure you keep them at a safe distance away from the road in case they make their way into the street. We don't want anyone running into them. Remember that this Halloween there is going to be many people stopping and hopping out to go trick-or-treating around the city. So please keep your speed to the posted speed limit in residential areas, which is 25 miles per hour. And make sure you're paying attention. We have a lot of small kids who could run out of any corner trick-or-treating. You paying attention and slowing down could help save a life. If you intend on trick-or-treating out of your vehicle, please make sure you pull over fully and turn on your hazard lights. And ensure your headlights are on. Make sure your children have some sort of device that helps reflect their light and the visibility, such as a reflective vest, a glow stick, or other such device. Feel free to stop by the firehouse if any of our firefighters or EMTs are online during this Halloween for a trick or a treat. Remember to have a safe, spooky, and fun Halloween this fall. And remember that the fire department will not be responding to any calls about ghosts in your neighborhood this fall. What?